to be safe. The nakiri, this one is that Japanese, it's a, a vegetable slicing knife or, or cleaver that's made specially for vegetables. But what's so fantastic about them, instead of the big giant old cleavers that are so heavy and thick, they're no, notorious for being very thin. And what's great about a thin blade is it glides through food and it makes it comfortable even if you're holding it to chop all the, the celery and onion for stuffing for your Christmas parties. But every one of the knives, Suzanne, is different. This is that um, slicer that's beveled. See the bevel on this side and the matching on this side? That makes this part of the blade really thin. So it goes through the meat or whatever you're slicing beautifully. And then my favorite of all, I love this one. When you have a serrated blade with a scallop instead of the reverse that's kind of sharp, it cuts your bread more gently. And that it's also thick enough to be a schmear knife and also deep enough to go down into that jar of mayo I love them. I'm so excited about these knives. <laughs> well, and you know, it's so crucial to have great knives. And here's the thing. You might know somebody on your Christmas list who's got really, like you went over to the house and you were helping them out and you're like, oh man, their knives stink. This would be a great set. And if with our flex pay, what are we doing it? For $6, it's five flex pays. You can get this home or we can deliver it directly to someone if you'd like us to for the exact same shipping cost, which is awesome. You don't have to ship it, then rewrap it and then ship that out. Let us do the work for you. But anybody who who's in the kitchen, anybody who cooks, anybody who, I don't know, even makes, I don't know, frozen dinners, whatever it might be, we all need great knives. And when you're in the kitchen and you don't have good knives, it's so very frustrating because nothing works well. Try to cut a thing as simple as a tomato and you ruin the tomato and you're like, man, I'm not a good cook, but look at this. A tomato is tough. Come on, of all the vegetables, I think that and a pepper are really tough to cut because of their skin. But you notice I'm not smushing it, I'm not mushing it. It's simply gliding through and popping off just beautifully beautifully and look at how awesome that cut is that's what you get out of a great set of knights and you don't have to spend a fortune to get them because wolf has put these and put his name behind them and made them for a single day and we buy in volume so you're really getting those volume savings simply by shopping with us but the deal ends tonight all right wolf is back with us he is now unfrozen chef what would you like yeah. to show us next all right now I'm making a little antipasto plate. You saw me making a delicious panini just a few minutes ago. Did we get a close up in here? Look at that. Look how beautiful. I mean, this is like a perfect panini. So you can slice the bread, smear on the mayonnaise and do whatever you have to do. Now, here we have Parmesan, but with my vegetable knife here, look how it goes through. It could be the cheese knife and then you cut it in chunks Put it on a platter and you have a delicious antipasti plate. You know, you're going to have people come over. When you buy cheese, buy it in chunks. So that way, it's so much better for you. Even really soft cheddar cheese or little Romano cheese or mozzarella cheese. Look how that glides through and it does not stick on it. It really stays the way it is. That's what I really love with these knives, you know. There's one for different things, or you can use it just for one. So it's simple, easy, but in any kitchen, you're gonna need good knives. Without good knives, it's a pain in the neck to cook already, you know, so you need that. Look, we chopped the parsley before, and then all we have to do is put a little olive oil on top, but because we cut it so nicely, you know, everything looks good, everything looks nice. So that's how I like, and you know, let me tell you one thing, 500 reviews, five stars, five stars. Can you believe that that's the highest rating you can get? Over 500 reviews. These are knives just like the famous German knives where one would cost probably 60 bucks, but because we have this in such high, we buy it in such high quantity and the quality can stay perfect. Look, when you wanna cut sausages, don't cut sliced sausages. Cut it whole and then you have a good knife and you cut it. So that way, you're gonna have a much better product because if it's pre-sliced, you know, it dries out. So this is the way to go. Oh yeah. Now, if it's simple things like onions, look at that. With the slicer, I can cut them as skinny as it would be. See that? Put them on your bagel. You don't want to have really some thick slices. You want to cut them nice and thin. And with this slicer, you can do it. See that? 
So sure. I love good knives in my kitchen. Chef, it's really a must for anybody. I think one of the and hardest things, let, Chef, to cut is going to be a pepper, right? Because that skin is so tough. Yeah. And look at this, you guys, going right through it. I'm not like, I'm not having to saw away. I'm not stopping. I'm not smushing it. I'm not ruining it. You can be precise and you're safer when you have really sharp, really good knives. And if you're struggling with really bad knives, why? You know, every day when you go to cook something, you're like, oh man, my knives are terrible. Treat yourself to these today. And here's the thing that I love about shopping with us right now. We have our extended return policy. Get these home. If you don't absolutely love them, you have until the end of January to use them and try them out and wash them and do everything you need to do. And if you're not absolutely crazy about them at the end of January, you can send it back for your refund, but you can only get the deal today. That's so important when it comes to a today's special. You've got one day, either it sells out or we get to midnight and then everything changes. And everyone can use this. It's not like, mm -hmm. a, it's not like a gift where you go, do they need knives or yet or not? Most everybody does, because most of their knives are dull or old, or they've hung on to them for a million years. This is the time to finally get that upgrade. Let me go over what you're getting one more time, and then we'll go back to Chef in LA. Remember, you're getting this paring knife, but this is the big brother paring knife. This isn't the small, little, normal paring knife. This is that more heavy-duty, more versatile paring knife that Chef has recreated for this brand new collection. Now, this one I think is awesome. It's kind of a butcher knife, but I just literally hacked up a bunch of herbs with it. It's yeah. fabulous. It's got a dual roll. This is that spreader. Oh my gosh, you'll never look at peanut butter the same. And it's not just those plastic ones that they sell out there. This is really heavy duty, made as, as well as any of the other knives and really effective. It cuts and it's gonna give you that big spread, especially if you love to do cakes. Now I love this big old chef knife. You know what, if like Marion said, if you're nervous of it, don't be. This one's really easy to handle. It's ergonomic, it feels good. And I love the new non-skid and non-slip handles. And then finally, this is gonna be the last knife with the eight inch slicing knife. This is the big guy. This is the one to do the roast and the turkeys and the big jobs. It's going to do it for you. But remember the five flex, everything we have going on is coming to a close as well as our guarantee to get it home before Christmas. We've only got a few more days to do that without any additional shipping charges. Hey chef, if you were to start somebody off in any yeah. kitchen, wouldn't yeah. knives and a good cookware set be the most two important exactly. things? Exactly. You know, that's the basics. And yeah. here now you have the basics really even this knife here the spreader knife or sandwich knife is color as color utility knife so you can cut your bread perfectly see that if you want to make sandwiches if you want to make french toast if you want to do cut a cake you can do it you can spread the mayo on top you can spread marmalade on top if you want to see that it's so easy that does everything for you now i'm gonna show you one of my favorite knives and every chef probably is the famous slicer here let me make a little space here look at that this is butternut squash you can see this is very hard now look at that can you see that it goes through like butter it's butternut squash but it's actually really hard and then we're gonna put it on a sheet pan here and roast it. You, in the winter time, you make roasted vegetables, they taste amazing, you know? So, mm -hmm. but you need a good knife to cut them all up. You're not gonna roast it all whole. So this goes so fast, so easy, whatever it is, onions, look at that. Cut it once in half through the middle and then Look at that. Here we go. Tomatoes, if you love tomatoes, if you find some really ripe one, you know, you have to take out the stem and there you need a little knife. It would be very hard to do that with a bigger knife. So see that, that's the little stem in here. And then you can cut it. Like if I would roast it, I cut it like this and then cut it in maybe into six. Here we go. See how easy? Into six. You wanna cut the zucchini? Here we have our vegetable knife. Nothing sticks to it. You can close your eyes and because of the little holes on the side and the ridge, it does not stick to it. So this is something you're gonna use every day. You're gonna give a knife as a present to somebody for yourself 
one knife you're gonna use every day. You know, a different one, maybe you make sandwiches, you cut your vegetables, you make your cakes, whatever it is, you need a good knife. So if you wanna get good roasted vegetables with your roasted chicken, your turkey breast, whatever, that's how you do it, see that? And then put a few fresh herbs, a little salt and a little pepper, and you're done. Put them in the oven and you have great vegetables. Eat them cold or warm with a little balsamic. It's delicious. Too. Hey, Chef, I gotta tell you, I love this little Nakiri knife too, because watch this, guys. This yeah. is celery. Now, what? Look at that. Look how crazy great this is. You know how stringy and tough celery is. How often do you okay. guys are just grinding through it, grinding through it, and you need it for a soup or stock or whatever. Look at this little Nakiri knife is just having at it. Yeah. That's chopped up in seconds. And while it's not exactly even to chef standards, it's gonna work for my soup. But you know what it did? It made cutting celery easy. And notice, see, no, even though I'm not great at it, because obviously I'm not a chef, there's no strings. See, there's no little strings on here. There's nothing, yeah. just no stragglers. That's what you get when you get a great knife. And what happens happens is, I think we all want to cook better and we're all at home cooking more than ever. And you're like, oh my gosh, all the prep, it stinks. Can I finally get to cooking? The prep took so much longer. When you have awesome knives, guys, the prep goes yeah. a lot faster. You're not digging for a good knife. You're not mad if you lose the one good knife. The good knife you have is now dull and it's frustrating. When you can prep fast and good knives allow you to do it, then you enjoy cooking more. And chef, wouldn't uh, you agree that you'll explore more recipes, you'll try new things, simply you have a Great exactly. knife set. You know, from chopping your vegetable to bringing a roast to the table, for example, now it's turkey time, turkey roast, whatever. Look at that here. I, it's a, 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 a turkey breast, and look how nicely I can slice it. And I don't squeeze it, so that way the juice stays right in the breast here. Look how nice and juicy the breast is, because I don't have to squeeze it with my knife. It glides through, perfectly sliced breast. So this could be your roast beef, this could be your pork roast, whatever you decide to do, and look how nice it cuts it. So here we have our turkey breast with a little bit of cranberry chutney here. Mm, you know, you should taste it, it is so delicious. And look at my board here, look at the board. There is nothing on here, why? Because I didn't have to squeeze the, I did not have to squeeze the roast. So this is really an important part. So you have the slicer, you have the spreader, you have the vegetable knife, the nikiri knife, you have them all. And we, what rather we have in the oven? We have some pork. Okay, let's get it out, let's get it out. We don't, ha we don't have that much time, you know. And let me tell you, it's really the quality of a German knife. I would not do it if I would not bring your quality. So this is the quality. Over 500 five-star reviews. I mean, how many products have that? Not many. This is as good as it gets. So if you wanna cut anything into slices, look, look at the pork chop here. The pork rack. See how it goes through? Yeah, it's gorgeous. I mean, anything you wanna cut, it cuts it to perfection. So if you have a roast at home, you wanna be able to really slice it perfectly and then put a little sauce on it, a little dressing on it, whatever it is. And again, look at my board here. No sauce, no juice, no nothing. Why? Because the knife is so sharp, it doesn't squeeze out the juices. So that's really an important part. Hey, Chef, I'm gonna do a quick update. Um, All right, no, now what else we have here to cut? 16,000 sets today. Again, if you want okay, the cute Mel. pink, I love the pink. This is your chance yeah. to get it before it is sold out. Then we have the teal blue, gray, black, and the red. You get them in a beautiful gift box. I love it because he always says awesome presentations. It's really bow ready, so no real effort there. You've got the five flex phase. All of it is put together for a single day and it all ends tonight. And Chef, I'm glad you did a melon because now you're going to be decorative with this, correct? I know. You know, we eat with our eyes first. And now oh. to make a beautiful melon, you know, make it look good. So you cut it zigzag like I did, and then you open it up, and you look at it, and people are going to say, wow, where did you go to cooking school? In Paris or in Austria or wherever it is? And take out the grains, take out the seeds, and look at that. 
So it's so simple, but you need the right tools. And when you have the right tools, you will go in the kitchen and also spend more time there because it's fun when you have the right thing to work with. You know, if you have a knife which doesn't cut, you try to do this, you try to do that, it's not that much fun. But here you can make everything look better. And that's what we are all about. You know, these days we don't spend a lot of time in restaurants. Our restaurants are all closed basically, but we sure. cook more at home. So I want you to cook at home and have the perfect utensils, the perfect knives, pots and pans. So that way you can be a better cook at home. And that's what we are all about. We wanna help you at home, but mostly we're gonna bring you the best quality. As I said before, 500, over 500 five stars review. These knives are as good as the best German knives or Japanese sure. knives. Very so true. I don't spare on quality. Only the best is good enough for me. So yeah, that's why that. I'm still here after over 20 years at HSN. Why we still are there? Because people know they get quality from us. So that's, that's really true. my most important part is give you the best quality possible. And you know, look at that. That's crazy. All right, Chef, we got to wrap this I, up I'm not real quick. You we have more to get to. Sorry about that, Chef, but we've got a lot packed in this hour with uh, Chef Wolfgang Puck. And stay on the line for this, if you will. I know we're a bit busy. Still to come, you guys are already grabbing this one, and it totally makes sense. How often have you wanted a beautiful universal mixer? Now, if you think about the mixers that are out there, some of the really famous ones, they're like four and $500. And quite frankly, they need their own house to live in. I mean, the things are giant, right? Well, imagine if you have one that's space savings, a nice big five quart, but gives you all the abilities that some of those very expensive mixers will. Look how different this is. Isn't this cool? And you'll see it breaks down. The bowl comes off, the blades are inside it. So we're gonna do a lot with that and it's coming up. Here's what makes it really different today. So stay with us. It's almost $80 off for the very first time, lowest price ever. So if you need that mixer, we've got a great one coming up, including a whole lot more. But first, I would love you to watch this next bit. This is HSN's 16th year as our partner in the St. Jude Thanks and Giving campaign. Since our partnership began, you have raised more than $13 million. How great is that? Because of you, no family ever receives a bill from St. Jude for anything, not for treatment or travel or housing or food. Because we believe all a family should worry about is helping their child live. Visit HSN Cares at hsn.com for more information on how to donate. I have journeyed around the globe. I've seen the beauty the world has to offer. Now I'm bringing you new fabrics, patterns, and soft silhouettes with spicy details. Exotic, but with a new degree of sophistication. Global Chic is all about fashion freedom. So be free. Iman Global Chic, only on HSN. you find your Mary because you're finding the perfect gift for everybody on your list. Hey, I'm Suzanne Runyon. Wolfgang Puck is joining us from LA. Of course, you know him as a restaurateur. He's been on television. He always does the big Oscar night and the, the list of uh, accolades goes on and on. And we love it that he's here with us because he's passionate about bringing great items to your home to make your cooking experience better than ever. This is indeed also last minute gifts. It means, hey, get them now because our guaranteed ship before Christmas with no extra charges coming to a close. We also have five flex during this period, and that's going to end here in a couple of days. So it's a perfect time to knock out that list. And speaking of knocking out, boy, I love this next item. And you guys have too. In the past, you've made it a customer pick at the full price of $45. Well, today we've got it on sale. It's a special limited feature price, and I'm down to the final 800. And this is your workhorse. This is the beautiful seven quart full stainless steel pot, and you get the glass lid to go along with it and on top of that you get this beautiful strainer designed to work right inside it as well so we'll talk about that in a moment all of that for under $40. And again, we've got that great five flex on everything at the moment. So we're gonna head back to LA and back to Chef. And Chef, I know this is one of your favorites and it's kind of one of those must haves in the kitchen like our knives. Absolutely, how are you doing? I'm good. Okay, now 
we have our beautiful pasta pot, but it's not only just to make pasta, but I'm gonna show you how amazing it is. When we cook our pasta in here, all right, we are still setting up a little bit, but we're almost done here. So I'll just show you a few things. So we have the pasta in here and the pasta cooker is on a hinge. So it moves actually, can you see that? So now you don't have to go anywhere with the pot. So the pasta is right in there you can actually remove the water just like that. Let me show you. See that? Oh, that's clever. All right. And the pasta stays here, hot. You don't have to take it to the sink or anywhere. So if you wanna use the pasta just like that, now you can take it out or put it back in the pot here Look at that, and put some pesto in here, some cheese in here, some olive oil, and you are done, okay? So easy, so simple. Here we have the pesto. All right, and now we stir it up. All in the same pot with no problem. Put a little Parmesan cheese on top, and you have a delicious pasta. Don't forget salt and pepper. Okay. Whew. Okie dokie, and naturally freshly ground cheese, freshly ground Parmesan. That's really an important part for any pasta. All right. Now I show you how much we made. So this is not only just a pot, it has a colander on it. And you can use the colander for other things, but it's great when you make pasta because you can do everything in one pot. True. And what do you love about the seven quart size, Chef? Huh? What do you love about the seven quart size? Well, first of all, it's so versatile. You can cook your potatoes, your pasta, your vegetables, whatever you think in here, your chili, your soups, whatever. I mean, everybody needs a stock pot like that. And on top of it, that it comes with a colander, I mean, that's really a great thing. If you cook your vegetables, you don't have to worry. Look, I cook them in the colander, and then it pivots like that. That's so clever. All right, now look at that. So now you have the veggies right in here. Let me come over here. If you want, put a little olive oil, some almonds, or whatever you want on it, but they're totally dry. If you want them steamed, just keep it that way. If you want to add something else, it's okay too. See that? And you didn't have to go anywhere with it. You can stay right where you are. Yeah. Hey, Chef, let's talk a little bit about the construction of this, including your base. Because a lot of people, yeah. if they want to try your line, I think this is a great price and a great pot to do it with. But let's uh -huh. talk about the base. How do you construct this? Well, this is triply, a triply base. You can see it has my name on it. What does it mean, triply? It's a layer of stainless steel. Why stainless? Because stainless is really the best way to clean and the most durable. But stainless alone is not a good heat conductor. So we sandwiched in between the stainless some aluminum. The aluminum is a very good heat conductor. Copper is a very good heat conductor. So you have all these things there. And I love stainless because we have them in the restaurant. Every restaurant we have has stainless steel cookware. So this is really the most important part, I think. So stainless steel <laughs> will help you always to be a better cook. And it stays like that forever. We have people who have that forever already, the cookware, and they say it looks like new because stainless steel, 1810 stainless steel is so durable. And you can look, use it for so many things. You can use the colander by itself here, or you keep it in your pasta. You can see it has the hinges, and then you just put it on the hinges in here, and then it stays like that. So and, you hey can chef, see it pivots. And you can use this on any cooktop, correct? On any cooktop, right. absolutely. I have induction cookers here. You can use any cooker you have. And, you know, we don't have a lot of space here, but it is so great to use. You know, it has the cover to look at that. We are cooking some butternut squash here. The same thing. That's so close. See that? <laughs> 
My sink is a little far away, so I just put it in here. <laughs> and look, here I have my butternut squash. No. All nice and hot. See that? Nice and dry. So if I want to put them in here with a little butter, a little maple syrup, and it will be delicious. Yeah, no, it's, it, you know what, it's again one of those really versatile pots to have. And I think yeah. at this price with our five flex guys, again, terrific gift idea. You might have someone who's a foodie or loves to cook. Chances are they don't have a seven quart. They might have a smaller yeah. one. Or Maybe they have a nine cream. quart that's pretty big. The seven quart yeah. to me is kind of perfect, whether it's a couple people or you're feeding the gang without taking up so much room. Also, when you go to store it, it's not like you need a ton more space because that colander, spinning colander fits inside and obviously the lid goes right inside and you're done. If you are thinking about that gift for that person and they really love to be in the kitchen, this is so awesome. And think about doing a small clam bake in here. Think about doing the big chili for the gang that comes over. We know eventually we will return to having friends and family over. The football team will come over for after the high school game. You need something this capacity to be able to cook up that storm. And you making us a soup, uh, chef? Making the soup here, so I took out most of the water because I don't want it to be too watery. Add a little syrup to it, a little touch of cream to it, and now we're gonna have a delicious butternut squash soup. Famous in our restaurant, add spices like cinnamon and so forth, and you're done. And by the way, guys, here's a quick update. I have about 600 of these yeah, now I remaining. I can smell the maple syrup in here. It gives it a little sweetness. It's delicious. And they're almost sold out. So if you guys are thinking about this, don't wait too all much longer. All right. You can leave it a little chunky or make it totally pureed. It all depends on you. Okay. So this part will serve you for everything. You know, obviously, it has the colander lid to cook the pasta. But to make your soup, to make your... Your, let me turn that down a little bit. Okay, to make your soups, to make your stews, to make your chilies, whatever you make, you can make in this pot. Everybody needs a spot like that. Eight in 10 stainless steel, riveted handles. I mean, this is the best quality possible. If you would go to any cook store, if you can get a pot like that for under 100 bucks, you can call me up. I will pay for it. This is really an amazing quality. Whatever you do, get one. For somebody who just started to cook or for somebody who is a professional cook, this will help you. And it cooks on every surface, induction, gas, electric, you name it, it will cook on it. Who knew eggs could do tricks? Marion, you're so good. <laughs> no, All right, look at so it. Good. The soup is it's done. So Marianne is making 100,000 eggs over there. <laughs> <laughs> she's she's getting a, she's getting a head start on Easter, uh, but I think what's really cool. Did you see how clever that is? I mean, there's not a yeah. pot out there that's going to do that. It's so amazing how you can just completely dump all the water with very very little effort instead of having to pick things through the water or strain it on something else and dirty something else up. Why bother going through that? All right, guys, here we go. There is about 500 now remaining, and then this is going to be completely sold out. You might want to think about putting some pot, dry pasta, some sauces in here, and then handing somebody the whole thing as a gift. That that would be an awesome holiday gift to give. And again, not I breaking know. the bank and, to do that. And you know, for $40, look at that. Here, I put some pomegranate seed on top of my soup here and maybe a few pumpkin seeds. And now you have it. Look, how fast is that? Can we get a close up here, uh, up there? Hello? Of the soup, I meant. <laughs> oh, you can get it. What there happened? we go. Ah. Here we are, here we are. It just takes him a little time because he's so far up on the mountain here to come down. It takes him a long time, so it's okay. <laughs> All right, guys, this is going to sell out. So you definitely want to go to hsn.com. It's a couple of clicks. Or you can talk to somebody and grab it before it's gone. It is beautiful. And remember, it works on all stovetops. And here's something interesting. If you're going to buy yourself a big quart, you know, a big quart stock pot like this, be very careful because if you have an induction, there's tons of so um, cookware out there that does not work on induction in the supermarts. Trust me, I've looked at them all, and you have to really read the label. You never have to worry about it when it's chefs. All 
of his cookware works beautifully on any surface, including those very popular new induction surfaces. So don't worry about that. So if you're giving it as a gift, you don't have to know what kind of stove they have, if it's gas, electric, whatever it might be. Obviously, too, this can go into the oven. It's oven safe uh, because it's gonna be able to handle the high temperatures because of the construction of that beautiful stainless steel. Tempered glass lids and the most clever strainer ever. We all agree with that. We wanna see more egg demos from Marion, for sure. <laughs> All right, guys, stay right there. This is almost sold out. Okay, I want to really give you a quick mention of our today's special. You know, how many people do you have on your list right now? And you're just like, man, I do not know what to get them. Like, I just, you know, everybody needs great knives. And I'll tell you what, I have been blessed to work with Wolfgang for now 15, going on 16 years. And he has done very successful knife sets. We always wait for him during the holiday season. This by far is the most improved. It is the newest all new construction, it's durable, and trust me, no one will ever think you paid $29 for it. They will not. And you can get it at home and prove me wrong if you want to. In fact, you have until at the end of January. And if you don't love them, guess what? You can send them back, but our extended return policy will be coming to a close. So it's a great time to shop. And it's something that every household needs. So someone's gonna really appreciate that if you get those on their uh, on your list and knock that off your list. Uh, we also have Flex on it, which is great, but the price, the whole deal, it ends at midnight tonight. All right, so a little heads up. We have sold several hundred of these already from that little sneak peek. It's $80 off basically, so it's an amazing sale price. And if you ever wanted those really big fancy mixers, well, they can be near $500 and they are big. You almost need to build a garage just to handle the size of the mixer. It takes up a lot of space on your countertop because you don't put them away. They're heavy, they're really heavy. Look how clever this is. Look at this space saving design that's going to give you, and it's got stickies on the bottom, so so it's gonna stay put when you're mixing the doughs, even the toughest stuff. Look at the capacity and yet look at how much space it saves. Yes, this is our five quart, 600 watt, and it's a programmable universal mixer. Now look at the clearance price. And once these are gone, that's it guys. And I do not have a whole lot of these going into the show. In fact, we started out with 900. And then just like my, my, my seven quart pot, when that's gone, that's gone. So here you go, you're getting your dough hooks. And wait till you see the demo. It's super cool how this works. You get your dough hooks included with it. You're also getting this beautiful five quart stainless steel bowl. You have the center lid, there's paddles, there's two whisks that go with it. You get a bowl scraper with it as well. So you get all of this including this incredible space saving but really durable mixer. So chef, you really took something and kind of turned it on its head. I'm sure no one has seen a mixer that that's that tough, uh, but yet such a great space saving design. Can we make it louder so I can hear? Chef, did you catch that? Why yeah. did you create you this mixer? What? This is the most amazing machine. Look at that. It has three functions. It has the bottle, the hook, and it has the mixer. It works on a planetary version. So you have not one mixer, but you have two actually in that. It's much faster. So here I'm making my chocolate chip cookies. I have the butter creaming in here. I'm adding the eggs, the sugar, some white sugar and some brown sugar. And then I'm gonna add the chocolate chip and some flour. So it's so easy because you can look it through the top here. See that? All right. And then we're going to add our chocolate chips here. Now, if you want, you can stop it also. So you just mix it well and then scoop it out so it's so simple and you have the controls right here time speed start stop okay you can put it on the timer and that makes it so easy to work with now look at that i stop it all right i take the cover off here i have my cookie sheet which you still can get which is non-stick with a silicone pad and we're just going to make our cookies from start to finish in no time. See that? Jeff, I know you love homemade bread and you have your bread maker. Yeah. How awesome would this be if you want to knead dough? All right. So now 
Okay, maybe Gary, yeah, you can finish that here. Because I have a few other things going on here. Okay, good. All right, here we have our chocolate chip cookies. Now here we have our pizza dough, as you can see with the dough hook in here. So we can speed it up a little bit, put it on speed, and then it flushes. See, you turn it up a little bit. And look, the feet are so strong that it doesn't move, you know. A lot of times you get a mixer, what will happen, the mixer will start to move away from your table. But this is really a perfect machine. Look at the dough, how it's moving here. And in no time, because of the two paddles, you're gonna have an amazing, an amazing pizza dough. See that, how it rolls it together already? All right, let's stop it. Take it off. And look in here. We have a little flour, maybe put a little flour and then take it out. Okay. Okay, look at that. So if you wanna make pizza at home or any kind of bread dough, this is the way to go. You cut it into four form little balls and you are done. Okay, I'm now gonna show... I'm gonna make chocolate mousse. Okay, Chef, hang on one second, because I wanna show everybody, because I think you just really get an idea how clever okay. this is. Here's what he's talking about. That was the pizza, and there's he was making the cookies. But you can see how fabulous and unique is this. See the scrapers on the side, bringing it, mixing it all together. Here you've got, obviously, your whippers, and what I love, your whipping uh, tool. What are you, no, that's a horrible name for it. No, it is the um, whisks. <laughs> <laughs> but it does whip, which is great. And see how that just pops in. Now, what's really cool about this is, watch me lift it up. So remember, this is super heavy duty, and yet I can put it away easily. It's not like it's a big unit and I'm gonna leave it out forever. So if you really love doing your baking or doing those doughs, those specialty breads, this is gonna be that gem in anybody's kitchen. Now remember, we have black and we have red. And I wanna know, is Marion ready? Because this is one of Marion's really core, core um, aspects of her life. She is a pastry chef and she's been with uh, Wolfgang for many, many years. And I just wanted to check with her because Marion, you know mixers, like you know them really, really well. Oh, and I'm so proud of him, Suzanne, for making a mixer that's like this. Why? Because it's a different way. The motor is on the bottom. Typically, they're up on the big head of the mixer. Yep. And the problem there is that that big head of mixer is in your way, right, to get into the bowl and do what you need to do. Wolfgang's is on the bottom. And it's lightweight, but look, it's got suction feet on it. They're so good. Even on a wooden countertop, it's not going anywhere. I love that when it's lightweight and I can see off the top of my work, I don't have to ask help getting this down off of a counter when I want to do any any mixing or baking. And let me tell you, baking has what's gotten me through this pandemic. I've been sad. I know so many of us have, had, have been that way. And you know, the other day I went to the grocery store, you're wearing the mask, you're having that mask hot flash, you know, where it's all hot under your mask, <laughs> buying your groceries. I'd singed my favorite wig on, the, wig on the barbecue grill that day. It was just such a bad day. And I came home and I put gingerbread cookies dough in my mixer and I watched it mix and I smelled that wonderful smell. And as I'm pulling, pull, punching out those cookies, I'm thinking of my precious children and grandchildren. Aww. Because now the way we get through this pandemic is we bake with love and then we put it in the mail and they get to open up those boxes. And you know, there's Aww. so much joy in that part of it too, Suzanne. Yeah. As parents and grandparents, it's our job to teach our kids and grandkids how to go through this pandemic and still find the humor and the joy. And let me tell you, when your wig gets singed off and you're doing all this stuff, it's funny, but this is what I love. It has so much power. And with that scraper, it's hands-free. I'm not stuck scraping it like you are. Normally, all the butter and sugar would be all collected around the right. sides. And the recipe is going to tell you over and over again to stop and scrape down the side. Not with Wolfgang. And this is how it's so cool. If I can really quickly show you how these go together. These are the two whisks. 
two is way better than one because right. it's twice as efficient, twice as fast. If you want to switch out for the cookie paddles, you just pull them out. It uses the same gear and they just pop on like this. So brilliant. If you want to use it with the, without the scraper, you can, but this is the scraper attachment. And all you're going to do is click it in like this. And then when you want to get it out, it'll click. And then when you want to get it out, up like this, pull the two tabs and it'll drop out. Oh, the brilliant. dough hook has its own built-in, but see, two dough hooks, two cookie paddles, two whisks. It's twice as efficient. And then one more thing real quick. Sure. Because it's digital. The reason that that's so important is because if you don't have a timer built into your mixer, it's really easy to under mix because you get so sick and tired of holding that, that hand mixer. On the other side of that, if you have a fancy um, stand mixer that has all that power and you get to just walk away, that's the tendency. You get on your phone, you walk away, and then you tend to overmix. Overmixing is just as bad as undermixing. If you want your results to turn out just right, just give this a try. To be over your work and work and look at it happen is so exciting to me. And guys, just another quick update. We have black or red. Which one's the most limited of the two, Jared, at this point? Because we have about 800 left, and then that's all we have. This is on clearance. It's a very, very popular item. We just have a few for the show, and then we're kind of selling them out and wrapping it up. The red I mean, is the most limited of the years. two. There's only 200, so the red's probably going to sell it here in just a second. But again, I love the fact you can take this off. You can store it away. It's really easy. If you've ever had one of those really big, very expensive stand mixers, gosh, you can't even lift the thing. Most people literally leave them on their counter and yet maybe only do baking a couple times a year. Maybe you bake a lot. Maybe you just want to make more things like homemade breads are delicious. You've got to have the power, the strength, but you're going to have the ease because of the way this is designed. And I want you to see that front face. That's what Chef was talking about and Marion was talking about. That's the digital controls. Here's your speed, your timer, your stop, and your stop, and you can make it go faster or slower. So you get that exact amount of pressure or speed that you need using this. All right, Chef, what are you showing us now? All right, are you coming back? Okay, finally, I was waiting, I was waiting. I'm making chocolate mousse. Now look, the beautiful meringue I have in here. Where is my guy here? Okay, look at that. So I'm gonna add some melted chocolate. And then I'm gonna add whipped cream to it. So you have the egg whites, whipped cream and the melted chocolate. If you want, like I add a little boost to it, if you want a little rum or any Tia Maria, whatever you like, or if you're like me, I like a little bourbon in there. Now look how easy it is because it's open on the top. So you can add whatever you want really easily. All right. Okay, this, let's clear it up. Yeah, a little boost, a little amaretto. All right, not too much, so the kids can have it too. And now, all we have to do is fill them up, stop it. Take it out, lift it up. Okay, look at that. Mm. Oh my God. You know what? If you have fish around, all they would do is say, just leave the bowl here. We're gonna eat it out of the bowl. Do we get a, a top one or from up there? Mm. Give me a spoon and a little chocolate powder. So you get your glasses, you can make that in advance and fill up some glasses. And that's it. So you have a dessert, which does not cost you a lot of money. Easy to make egg whites and a little cream and a little chocolate. And you know for how much you have here? For a whole family of 12 for sure. But that won't last long because people like it so much. So, okay. Now, if you want, you put powdered sugar on top. You can put chocolate powder on top. You decide how you want to serve it, okay? Now, I will put it in the refrigerator, cool it off. Yeah, put a little raspberry on top or... 
if you don't have raspberries, put a little powder on top, a little chocolate powder. Okay, we'll put it everywhere, all around. Okay, good. Look at that. Maybe another raspberry with a little color here. And here we go. You have a delicious dessert, and it does not cost you a lot of money. And you will eat it. Mm. It is so good. Now let's clean this up a little bit here. I made it a little messy, but it's okay. Now, you could see I made the pizza dough here a few minutes ago. And look how perfect the dough is. Give me a little knife, maybe. Oh, here we have it. See, my knives come in handy. Cut the pizza dough in pieces. Oh, look, that's a good dough already. Ow. Okay, good. Put a little thing, a little flour, and we mash it together as a little ball. Okay, let's clean up here. Okay. Look at that. So you can make your pizza, your bread, whatever you make, just like that with the dough hook. All right. So here's what we're going to do. We're checking back with Marion, too, because she's got another demo she wants to show us. If you want the red, that's the most limited of the two. And this is another one of those products that if you know someone who really loves to bake or they love being in the kitchen, this is something they'll adore. Maybe they've been driving you crazy about getting the $500 big heavy thing that takes up half the counter. This is such a great alternative. And you know what's nice? Maybe you're afraid. You're like, okay, she really wants the big thing. But this is where we're at budget wise. We think this is going to save a lot more space and it's going to be just as good get it at home and that person who loves to bake or cook has until the end of January to really put it through its paces. Try the timer, put the goodies in there, make the breads, make the, the, the beautiful mousses or whatever it is that you want to create. And if they don't love it, they can send it back at the end of January. But this is a game changer simply because it doesn't take up much space. It doesn't take up the room. It's much easier to work with. If you've ever worked with that big thing, it's like and it's hard to get stuff in it. This is so simple because of this brilliant open design. Look at this. Literally, without even reading the instructions, I figured out how to close it up and how to take it off. And I figured out yeah, how to lift the middle up and change these out. So it's just absolutely intuitive and you don't have to spend $500 to get one of those great big stand mixers. So Marion, I'd love to go back to you. What are some of the other things you love to do with this? Oh my gosh, I love so much the way the lid is because on my other stand mixer, which I'm not bashing at the big, beautiful red one, it's my showpiece on my counter. But you know what? That's just it. It kind of is a showpiece that just kind of sits there. This is my friend that I go to over and over again. The lid, Suzanne, is brilliant. It's two piece. So this kind of protects you from a lot of the splatter. If you're doing something like whipped cream, believe me, you want to cover that whole thing up so you don't wear all of that all over your kitchen. But it's just so easy. It just lifts on and off. You don't have to use it to, to have it. But the genius to me is that scraper that Wolfgang built in. And remember, you've got the digital um, speed. So you just turn it on here. You can increase or decrease your speed here. And then uh, this is also where you would set your timer right here. But that scraper that Wolfgang built in, there's no more drudgery in a recipe, especially if it's something sticky like brownies or cheesecake, than stopping to scrape that bowl over and over again. Or how many times have you poured that mixture in to the pan and you see that you didn't do a good job scraping it? And there's big lumpy things of butter and stuff in the bottom because you didn't do a good job. Well, that'll never happen here. Notice I don't have any big pink, but this is buttercream frosting, but I don't have any pink stuff stuck to the sides of the wall because it's scraping it all down for me. So I get to just sit here and, ha and play, and I'm dreaming of the day where I can make a big batch of buttercream, put it all in colorful decorating bags, and have those grandbabies gathered around where we're making cookies and decorating them. But this is how easy it can be. I love that with that timer, it's precision. You're not gonna overmix, but isn't this just a better way to mix? I love my big one, but I love this one too. I think you need both. Well, and I also think though, Marion, you, you obviously are a very serious uh, bakery chef and that kind of thing. For the rest of us, we want to do the fun breads and the pizza doughs and all these great recipes. I don't wanna invest 
$500 in a machine that has to stay on my counter all the time. So wouldn't you say this is great for that kind of either wannabe, maybe want to explore baking or different types of bread cooking and things like that? Don't you think this would be a great unit as opposed to the big, very expensive one? I think that's perfectly said. You know, we have to budget our dollars, but if you know that you have a child, grandchild in your life that's been mesmerized by the baking shows as we go through this pandemic, to encourage them with something like this, you're not breaking the bank. It's Wolfgang Puck, which is such a great name. You know he loves sweets more than anybody I, I know on earth. So that's the perfect person I would want to have and get a mixer to give. But imagine if you're the one that's making a budding Wolfgang Puck that's showing them a way that they can have a mixer where they can wash their work so easily and where the results just turn out so beautifully. I think you said it exactly right. Not too much money made by a chef who knows exactly what we need to have, especially in the world of baking. Yep. It's just a genius addition. And I think if you gave this as a gift, you'd make some people really, really happy. Oh my goodness, yeah. And you know, chef, you don't have to spend a fortune to get the kind of power and performance. In fact, I think this is smarter with that double blade spatula. That is a brilliant concept. I'll show it to you. Chef, did you see that? Chef, are you with me? I just want to show you guys what Mary's talking with you. about. I'm eating tiramisu here. We made some tiramisu and uh, <laughs> with mascarpone there. and whipped cream, so it's really amazing. Oh, you know how much I love sweet. This is perfect. So you put the lady fingers on the bottom, the coffee, and a little liquor, tia Maria or whatever, and then mascarpone and whipped cream mixed together with sugar, a little powder sugar on top, or powder chocolate on top, and. Mm. Hey, Chef, what do you think is the uh, biggest mistake that people make when it comes to baking? Well, you know, the hardest thing with baking is to make everything fluffy. You want to make whipped cream, make it fluffy. Make your egg whites, make them really fluffy. If you don't have a machine, a lot of people out there try to mix their egg whites in plastic bowls, in glass bowls. It's so difficult. With this machine, you can look at it from the top. It makes it so much easier, you know, because you can see into it. You can lift it up. Plus, it has two whisks in there. So it circulates in a planetary motion, which means it goes around by itself, but also around the bowl. And it scrapes the bowl. So. Once you're gonna use that machine, you're never gonna use another one again. This is, you're gonna say, how come Wolfgang, it took you so long? And you have the speed, you have the timer. If you put dough in it, you can put the timer on it. You have five flex pay. This is really, really an amazing machine. Yeah. So I use it at home, my kids use it at home when they make even a little whipped cream or chocolate mousse by themselves. It is special. And remember, you can use just the spatulas by themselves, just the uh, whisk by themselves, or you can use the dough hooks by themselves. All of this can be used independently, or as you can see here, the brilliance is put together. Because how many of you have to get in there and scrape the bowl down and stop the mixer and scrape again? You don't have to do that anymore. He's taking care of all of it. I think this is absolutely brilliant. And you know darn well, nobody else has anything like this except this yeah. specific unit if you want the red this is the last chance we will not have the red after this hour so if you want the red this is your last chance to get it and what happens is the red will sell out and then all of a sudden everybody will just jump on the black because it's still available i did want to show everybody one more time another brilliant feature chef this thing ain't going to move because listen to that did you hear that there are four and these babies are awesome they there's four knobs that they literally pressure push down just a teeny bit and that i can literally look you guys i am moving my entire demo table just by pushing on the the mixer so if you're doing something really heavy duty a lot of mixers will start jumping and crash off your countertop with this it's going to stay put your countertop will fall off before this thing comes off all right uh, marion what are you doing next will you show us love this so much, Suzanne, because with Wolfgang, there's a double dough hook. Hey, it's got a little bit of flour on it, but let me show you. Normally, a dough hook looks kind of like this. It looks like a hook. Well, look what Wolfgang has. There's two of them. Can you imagine? And here's that scraper built in. So not only am I not scraping, if your recipe calls for 12 minutes of, of mixing, it's probably going to be ready after six. But imagine if you have the dough hooks on your hand mixer and the Christmas bread recipe tells you to mix it for 12 minutes. Are you kidding me? You're standing there. You're like, oh, it has to have been 10 minutes. And you look at your timer and it's been three. You want to check that email. You want to go do anything but stand there and hold that thing. And then pretty soon it starts to smoke. I think we've 
all have those hand mixers, but this is just a better way. If you want to make those things, we're all baking bread and we're making things that we've never made before and having such a good time doing it. I think this is the time where you treat yourself and you get this mixer and you see what Wolfgang is all about. Get something different in your life and just have fun because baking is my comfort. It's how I show my love. And if that's how you are, give it a try. I think you'll love it. Hey, and, and Marion, you know, again, you can see the power and you can see the speed. And she made such a good point about the timing, being able to get that exact 12 minutes, not too much, not too little, just to get that perfect fluffiness and the pure, and everything thoroughly mixed. By the way, you're going to get the uh, instructions that come with it. You can do things like cookies. Uh, um, I love it. Chocolate chip cookies, gluten-free cheese biscuits. Oh my gosh. If you love making homemade breads or homemade biscuits or homemade donuts, you're going to absolutely adore this. Maybe you've always wanted to do that with the kids and you're like, or the grandkids, and you're like, oh no, I don't have a mixer that's heavy duty enough to be able to pull those things off. This is gonna do it for you. I wanna check back in with uh, Chef one more time. So Chef, again, what is your favorite feature? What do you love most about this mixer? Well, what I love about it is the power, the 600 watts, which is amazing. And then the versatility where you can make the fluffiest egg whites or whipped cream or mascarpone cream for a tiramisu, for example. Or you can make your mashed potatoes in there. Or you can mix your meat for make meatloaf in there. The versatility of it. So you have three different things. You have the whisk, you have the dough hook, and you have the paddle. So that's what I love. I love to have one machine where you can do a lot of things. If you wanna make the fluffiest mashed potatoes, just cook the mashed pot the potatoes in our pot, the one you just saw before, the pasta or potato pot with the colander and then throw them in the mixer, a little cream and butter and it's gonna be perfectly delicious. And on top of it, you get some of my favorite recipes in here, like the Saha Torte, like the Linza Dog cookies and so forth. So you will be a baker at home. And if you have the right machine, you don't have to work out. You just throw the ingredients in like you saw me with the, with the cookies here. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's so simple and so easy. I really like to have that machine and I have it at home. Why? It has everything I will ever need. And it has the stainless steel bowl, so you don't have to worry about it. Yeah. It has the dual action where the the, the whisk or the, the, the bottle turns on itself and it turns with the machine. So it goes Brilliant. twice as fast, really. So you right. have the dough hook, the cookie bottles, the wire whisk, and the bowl scraper. Everything in one machine. If you would like to buy that, it would be expensive. And it's a 600 yes. watt motors on five speed settings. So you have all this speed, whatever you need. Okay, Chef, we gotta wrap it up. We're gonna be back because we're gonna take another look at our today's special live with Chef Wolfgang Puck joining us from out in Hollywood, California. And we've got his favorite mixing bowls coming up that are always a huge success. So we'll see those in just a moment. But first, HSN Cares here at HSN is dedicated to empowering women and children and helping families in times of need. We'd love you to join HSN Cares in support of St. Jude Children's Research Hospital so that families never receive a bill, listen to this, for treatment, travel, housing, even food. Isn't that amazing? We've highlighted many powerful patient stories this last couple of weeks, like Quincy's throughout the campaign. Please watch this. Hi. Nice to meet you, old man. Now, this young man, Quincy, he's got some lines to his song, and he's going to help me write a song, his song. And we're going to debut this wonderful song that's going to win a Grammy. <laughs> to see the children and to see the way St. Jude takes care of them, that's the reason why uh, I'm, I'm a part of this thing. Because what you see now will be the beginning of a great future. And, you know, St. Jude is helping that happen. And please visit HSN Cares at hsn.com for more patient stories and information on how to donate. And together, we can truly, truly make a difference. So please check that out, if you will. All right, well, here's what we're hap what's going to happen next. Uh, Chef Wolfgang Puck's going to join me live from Hollywood, California. We're going to take a look at a very popular Knife Today special and a couple more things next hour. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. 
people really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. about shopping at HSN for the holidays? Oh, that one's easy. Flex Pay. Flex Pay is like Santa's little helper. It allows me to get everything on my gift list and make monthly payments with no interest or fees. Even if you're on the naughty list. I got a gaming system for my nephew, a pair of funky boots for my sister, and a little something just for me. Flex Pay allows me to be the best gift giver I can be without the worries of paying for all of my holiday shopping at once. Beat that layaway. I love watching cooking shows. I will admit, I'm not the best.